elsewhere, Barbie is Warner Brothers' billion dollar baby. Global ticket sales for the hit movie topping $1 billion over the weekend, becoming just the second movie to pass the mark this year, just behind the Super Mario Brothers movie released earlier in 2023. Abby has more. Hey, Abby. Hey, John. And yeah, we do have Barbie joining not just Super Mario Brothers, but about 50 other uh, films that have grossed uh, more than $1 billion in global ticket sales, joining the likes of Titanic, Avatar, Jurassic Park, these real iconic, iconic films. So perhaps Barbie is on that trajectory. It certainly seems as though it is. And as you mentioned, it's just the uh, second to do so this year. Confirmation came around 2 a.m. Uh, this morning from Warner Brothers. Uh, it happened yesterday in terms of surpassing $1 billion. Now, the stock is up about 8% since Barbie's release about three weeks ago, helped out by some of that Barbenheimer magic, uh, a big accomplishment for sure for Greta uh, Gerwig. This year, uh, we have Warner Brothers, John, up 47%. The company, of course, merged uh, last April. It's expected to be pop profitable in the fourth quarter. Relative to Mattel, up less on the year, up more than 10%. Today, though, Mattel up 1.8%. It's best day uh, since July. The question will be whether or not Warner Brothers can give up some of the premium. Right now, it's trading at a huge premium to the group. It seems as though Barbie can help its numbers move in the right direction. I still have not seen this film, John, but I have had a couple people come up behind me and say supposedly a big line in the movie, hey, Barbie. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it, but I will see it when it comes out on streaming. I just don't feel the need to go to the movie theater and watch that just yet.